Thanks so much for joining us on um, the Bald and the Beautiful podcast. We'd like to have a word from our sponsors. Spring sunshine calling your name. Hello Fresh's new fast and fresh options are ready in 15 minutes or less so you can get the meals on the table. Then get outside. Get 16 free meals plus free shipping with code TBTB16. TBTB16. <laughs> at HelloFresh.com slash TBTB16. TBTB16. Welcome to the Ball and the Beautiful podcast where we talk about reality shows and whatever else the heck we want to talk about. Whatever. Hoka. Hoka. I am Melissa. My name is Kevin Allen Fredericks III. I am Angel. Marcus. And listen, this is where we are today, okay? And that's why I say wherever. Just go with us where we go, okay? Go I need you to be like Ruth. That's exactly what hey! I'm saying. Your be God like will be Ruth. my God. Your God will be my God. Your people will be my people. Naomi and Ruth. Come on, Naomi and Ruth. I need you to be the Ruth, okay? So this is the situation. Well, don't cover Oh, please. I didn't know what was happening. I went so way this too is, high for how close you were. Yeah. <laughs> this is, I don't know why. I, I was like, this <laughs> is how you do it. Put your hand behind her. <laughs> also, was it looking? I was still like, I, I thought you were going to me. My arms started getting hot. Listen, that workout today. Um, okay, so this is what happened. Vanderpump Rules is a show that is on Bravo that I have never, ever heard of. You had never heard of it? Child, not Lisa Vanderpump? I, I yes. didn't know Lisa. I didn't know. Matter of fact, I'm going to tell you how bad I didn't know her. This whole time, I thought people were saying Leafa. Oh, my God. Um, so, yeah, I missed who Lisa Vanderpump was. But for those of you who live in the world that I live in, um, she is a former... A real housewife of Beverly Hills, I apparently. Oh, this is a yes. spinoff from that. Her red. She owns a bunch of. I'm going to drink them. She owns a bunch of restaurants her in red. Beverly Hills. Yes, and so she got her own spinoff. Her where red. They focus on her dysfunctional staff, the team. So she was. That's where the show came yes. from. Yes. So Lisa Vanderpump is uh, one of the original OGs from the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. Apparently, Andy Cohen wasn't even convinced he was going to do the show. Saw her audition and was like, "She's fantastic." She joins the show. She becomes a fan favorite. She's been rich for a long time. She got money. Time. Oh, her she money. really her, had money. Yes, her Ooh. money. She is, wasn't a housewife like my no, husband no, no. or something. She's an she actual, the, money. the definition of housewife, meaning rich. Yeah. So she's had money for very much, very much, long, 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 long time. You know, restaurants in Beverly Hills, you, you got to have Correct. some sort of money. She owns Sir. Have y'all heard of Which Sir? Which Sir is what this show, Vanderpump Rules, is on. That's the staff. Mm -hmm. And she used to own Bella, Bella Note. Bella Nota? Bella Noche? I think it's Bella Noche. Uh, Bella Noche. You Bella can't Noche. go down to what Bella Noche is. Where the hell can I you go? I was trying to get the list of her restaurants, <laughs> but she had, like, restaurants that people would be, like, waiting to try to, like, get into. Yeah, get bars and restaurants. And, oh, like is I that said, why Tom Tom? Correct. So her original relationship was with Tom and Tom, Tom Shorts. Listen, I've been all on the TikTok and the YouTube trying to understand who these folks were so I can explain it to y'all who might be in the same boat as me. Vila Blanca. I ain't in your That's boat. I'm, I'm in your boat. I, I, I made it up. I uh, said, Bella Noche. No, I felt like I heard that. Yeah, it says Vila, from that Vila Blanca. Oh, then maybe that's... I felt like I heard it I'm in the not situation. in your boat. There's a boat behind you that's pulling a life raft. <laughs> that's where I'm at. I, I'll pull you. But she's owned 36 restaurants. In Dang! As well. Yes. Yeah, she's rich, rich. Like, for real. 36 so, restaurants. Yes. So, yeah. she had a relationship originally with Tom and Tom. That's Schwartz and... Sandoval. Thank you, mm -hmm. Sandoval. Sandoval. Yes. yes. Then... Apparently, it gets real incestuous after that. I'm not even going to try to explain it. Yes. It's like he was dating this person, and then mm -hmm. they broke up, and she started cheating on Sandoval yes. with this person. Uh -huh. And then when she was when they were still together, though, he started dating Ariana, and then she was like, thanks so much, because it was dysfunctional That's anyway. That's I was telling you about today, this morning. Oh, yeah. And then, hello? <laughs> and then uh, she was started dating the, other, the James dude, who I thought was gay. Apparently not gay at all. That's the dude with the accent? Yes. Oh, he ain't gay. No. Was engaged to the cheetah girl, Raquel. Didn't know. Oh, they oh, all just sleep that. with each other. That's what I'm saying. It got real. I watched this TikTok. She was drawing lines. I said, I'm confused. Listen, that's what I put. Vanderpump Rules relationship charts so that it'll be easier for me to follow. It got very much. Look like a it was spider web. Grey's Anatomy. Ah. And that's why I got out of Grey's Anatomy because I was like, so all y'all essentially just slept with each other. Y'all do realize that? Or mm. no? Mm -hmm. I'm confused. That's very much what it was given. Okay. All of that to say, uh, I've watched TikToks and YouTube videos about these folks' lives. I've watched one episode of the show. <laughs> 
<laughs> we yeah, watch okay, season 15, too. episode 10. This is yep, correct. Exactly Listen, right just here. text us in the group chat. Hey, y'all hey, watch yeah, Vanderpump <laughs> Rules season 15, episode 10. I said, what? when I saw Vanderpump Rules, whatever rules, I thought that was an episode <laughs> that one of the couples just took over on married co- uh, marriage couple. Uh, what's it called? What'd you say now? Married first sight. Mar- 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 the one we was reviewing. Couples therapy. Couples therapy. Couples therapy. I thought Vanderpump was one of the people, couples, and they they took over the whole episode. I was like, oh, okay. Pause and acknowledge the old blackness of. Old listen, I old thought listen. that that was a couple on. Uh, what, what, yeah, what, what, couples. <laughs> Call. Couples therapy, Villa Blanca, Villa Noche. Oh no, and y'all ain't been seeing me trying to read was, these tiny words. Listen. I've been like, "Is she did?" Poor. So now, what yes. the hell? Let's got us watching again. Listen now, to yeah. me. Who's the Vanderpump? Okay. Take take me back to couples therapy. No, listen, I'm a I'm a try to <laughs> let me see if I can send y'all the uh, the little TikTok situation. I sent it to Mel and Greg. I mean Mel and Greg, Mel and Kev, because uh, I, I am now watching the reunion. I won't watch anything else. No, I'm not going not back. Necessary. I'm not watching all the other seasons. You're going forward the either? heck no. All I'm doing is watching what I watch, the reunion, <laughs> and I'll be out. <laughs> and what I'm noticing is that this girl, Raquel, this chart really is helpful. Yes. I might put this link inside I'm, the thing because the chart is helping me a lot. Mm-hmm. The Raquel girl who's, respo- who's one of the people responsible for this whole blow up, she not only... Cheated with Schwartz, yes. even though he was in a whole relationship. Yes. Wait, okay? Schwartz? I mean, Sandoval. Yes. She, oh. But she was dating. She had a fling with him a while ago. Yes. With, with Sandoval or Schwartz? Yes, so she Schwartz. had a, 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 a fling with Schwartz. That's the white man with the blonde hair. That was only concerned dogs. about. Okay, wait, let's start. Go go through your thing. We can start. So Raquel, who is the the mistress, is what we'll, we'll see her as. She was friends with Ariana. Who, Correct. Who was with the dark haired Tom. Tom? The dude Sandoval. that looks like Johnny Depp. Yes, the dude who looks like he's about boy. to audition for just, the Let's Zorro. just call him Johnny Depp. That's Johnny Depp. Because they both Toms. Johnny Depp. She finds out via going through his phone that he has been seeing Raquel, who has ingratiated herself to Ariana for them to be friends. She's like, we're besties. We love each other. Oh, and then she started like smashing kids. her dude. The yes. same ones. Now, Raquel, though, which I didn't realize, <laughs> at one point in time had a fling with Schwartz. That's the other Tom, blonde haired Tom with the dogs. Dog Tom. Right, Dog Tom and Johnny And Depp. was engaged to James. She was engaged to James. Oh. That's not the only part. This is the part this that's This is stupid. Me. I didn't know she was she engaged. She also yeah. had an affair with some nan named Oliver and uh, claimed she didn't know that he was married. They need, don't to, really count if you didn't know they need to do a cruise reunion and sink the ship. Oh. I just posted the TikTok. It's a history. very small group of people. You, they don't even need a full cruise. You can put 100%. them on a boat. <laughs> but this small is, yacht. This is the thing about Sandoval Johnny Depp that I told Marcus today. He said, oh, God. So he gets called to the table and has to explain himself to one of his friends, a uh, dark-haired girl. Uh, she's with Schwartz. Katie? No. Lala? No, Lala got blonde hair. It's was it Sheena? No, nah, nah, it wasn't Sheena, but it was somebody. Somebody was like, explain yourself, because you did, maybe it was Sheena. And she said. Because it was his, I think Sheena was his friend that predates his, her yeah. friendship. Uh, Sheena, oh, yeah. Sheena she, with Brock. So who is the girl? No, it's the girl who, who scratched old girl. But Sheena's with Brock. That was their Sheena's apartment. Sheena's the one who scratched her. I think it was Sheena then. But no, Brock but has... That's it don't her. matter. Go. But yeah, you were talking about the short-haired girl who he brought the dogs to the house to. Yeah. Who was that Brock girl? had the ponytail. Remember? She had the all white no, on. Remember, I didn't know who... All these white that's people true. were the same people until last night. So somebody said to him, you're terrible. And I knew the girl in Miami was telling the truth. Because the girl yes. in Miami was like, we had sex. He was like, no, yes. we didn't. And then his girlfriend was like, don't you talk yeah, about my it, They're saying it was Sheena. So... Was Sheena? Sandoval says, Johnny Depp says, Ariana knew the whole time. She knew the whole story. She was like, so outside of Raquel in Miami, girl, have you ever cheated before? He said, one other time. I said, no, this is sweet. Yes. This, she was like, was some cheater. random girl? He was like, yeah. No. Well, no. <laughs> your mom banged her. I watched this. Th- right before uh, your sister. Listen, the white people yeah, be on this. Well, you hear me? I was funny. watching the you the white versions of what we do for the white shows yeah. today. Oh. 
The girl says she think alleged, alleged, whatever the words are, don't sue me, child. I'm just repeating what I heard. <laughs> she think it's somebody from the Bachelor Nation. Oh, oh. no, they don't. Because apparently they're, they be cozied up in another show that I don't didn't this even This is recognize. the Marvel child, Multiverse. I said, uh-huh. well, this, I might be in for next season. It depends how this shake out. Oh, sorry. This, this depends how this shake out. I might be in for next season. Multiverse of sex. Okay, so let's start. So that's a lot of history. Yeah, they you uh, They just, so they on. are, it's, it's so white. Marcus. Oh, my it's God. It's like 5,800,000 5, Kelvin white. Like, it's white, white. It is white. Their white voices are so the white. The voice, oh, my God. And honestly, I told Melissa, I, I had to rewatch. I oh, no. could not tell these people, the, the women, <laughs> I could not tell them apart. Welcome to my world. I was like, <laughs> is Raquel is with, is she in the room? How I live right my now? life. Because <laughs> no, a I lot of, the scene I was like, I thought. I watched it last night. I was watching YouTube videos as this was playing, so. <laughs> I was watching and was confused. At least you had a distraction. No, I knew I was about to be confused. Listen, <clears throat> I said, "Man, what the hell they build this car?" Is with uh, Cheetah Girl and, and Sheena. There yes. you go. Okay, Raquel and Sheena. Yes, Raquel and Sheena. I thought Sheena was the was one Ariana. Had- yeah. Oh, absolutely. Until last night. Cause 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 when I'm, they glad, said, I'm glad y'all finally seeing Sandoval. the world through my eyes. Yes. Listen, he was like, "Who's hotter, Tom Sandoval or Tom Schwartz?" And they both said Sandoval. And then they looked at her like, ooh, why are you saying that? And then Andy was like, why are you saying that? And I'm like, why both of y'all say it why, then? Why? It's okay for her. None of y'all with him. Exactly. That was my thing. Like, if neither one of y'all are with Tom, uh, Sandoval. Johnny Depp. Thank you, Johnny Depp. Why is it okay for either one of y'all to say the answer? That's, that, that's my first question. And Andy, why you even ask that question? Because Andy they knew. Messy. They knew. Oh. You know Andy's going to be messy. They knew. Uh, <laughs> I think So they she would have said, sure, she's like, why you didn't say Sandoval? Because y'all had sex with him. Wait a second. Wait a second. But who keeps screen recordings of FaceTimes? It did. I had the same thought. I said, who does that? Because he is. He had a wanted to get caught. No. Be- hold I up. Hold up. <laughs> this motherfucker. He said, this is one part I was paying attention. He said, I was going out, whatever the name of the club is. All she had to do was follow me and see that oh, I wasn't my going God. there. God. <laughs> it was her fault. That, Marcus, that, that she didn't positive. follow me. If yeah. she really cared to find out that I was cheating on her, when I told her I was going to Schwartz's house, if she cared, she would have followed me to Schwartz's house oh and found out I wasn't going I there. I said, Apollo has entered the building. Said, you know what? That is, that is her fault. It is all her fault. She, all she had to do all was, she had to do was follow, follow me and know me. I was lying and being deceptive. All she had to do was catch me. I mean, if, then she I cared. Cared. Yeah. if she cares. That was one of my YouTube videos hit a commercial, so I tuned in. I was like, what's going on over here? <laughs> I tried to break up with you two weeks ago, and he you sure wouldn't did. let me. I was oh, like, my God. He kept saying you, that. You've been cheating for seven months. Seven? What? The the fuck, was two no, weeks Angel, ago. That's not what he said. He said, I tried to break up with you, but I got a vibe that you didn't want to hear that information from me. <laughs> yeah, he Melissa said, said, who wants to hear that they got cheated on? People are lunatics, man. What vibe will let, what vibe could she have that be like, you know what, today is the day to tell her that I cheated. Your vibe <laughs> is, is is giving me the inference that you want to be told that I've been cheating on you for seven months. He smells like butt. That's what he looks like. He smells he looks like he and smells weed. like booty B.O. Doesn't that sound funny? Yeah. Having it, not so much. <laughs> That's why I'm so excited to tell you about Lumi. It's the world's Ooh, best whole yeah, body it. deodorant. I've been using Lumi on my balls. Okay, well, listen, I have some in my purse because I left the beach and went to a birthday party and was like, oh, no, I'm going to smell like Shamu. Mm-hmm. I, I don't want that for that's everybody else. Th- them whales killing them boats. No, that <laughs> Angel forgot her Lumi. I my Lumi. <laughs> Uh, the world's best whole body deodorant. It's clinically proven to control odor everywhere, pits, privates, and beyond for a whopping 72 hours. As an OBGYN, Lumi's founder, Dr. Shannon Kleeman, met thousands of women concerned with odor below the belt. Through clinical testing, she discovered it wasn't the vagina to blame, but bacteria on the skin. She created Lumi, a pH-balanced, optimized, aluminum-free deodorant that actually works and works everywhere with over 150,000 five-star reviews to prove it. Listen, Lumi is actually really, really easy to use, and you can be very discreet about it. You know how when you, like, you, like, do I smell? And you don't really want to have somebody else smell you to tell you if you smell. So you just, like, you know what, let me just take care of it before somebody smells me. Lumi is so easy that if you out and about, 
you could just run into the bathroom, hit the hit the problem areas, pat, 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 and then you're done. Okay. Um, so uh, I, that's what I like about it. It's really simple to use. It's actually I have like a travel size one. It's really small, fits into my purse. It doesn't have to be like a big old bags of wipes that you're trying to clean yourself with. No, just deodorize. Just you know, get yourself smelling fresh. Uh, and yeah, I was surprised at how well it worked. Um, so again, it's whole body deodorant. It's created by an OBGYN. These are the things that make it so unique. And it blocks odor all day. And it's aluminum-free, baking soda-free, and paraben-free. Mm. And pH balance for safe use below the belt. Lumi Starter Pack is perfect for new customers. It comes with a, so- a st- solid stick deodorant, cream tube deodorant. That's what I have, the cream tube deodorant. And two free products of your choice, like um, mini body wash or deodorant wipes. And free shipping. As a special offer for our listeners, new customers get $5 off a Lumi Starter Pack. With code TBTB, TBTB. at LumiDeodorant.com. <laughs> that equates to over 40% off your starter pack when you visit LumiDeodorant.com and use code TBTB. TBTB. Um, Danny got me on this before, actually, they were a podcast ad, and it really does work. Kev was using it all up and through Dubai. Actually, he used it this morning. I I'm use it every from. day. Yeah, he, I'm not even I'd be to. sweating, and I want my balls to smell fresh all the time. Oh, hello. I just messed up. Okay. I love this smell of All right. So let's start from the beginning, from the top. So first, this man, let's talk about their scene when they are talking about, uh, they're in the, essentially their um, living room Uh and they're having the conversation about like what's happening in their feelings. There are a couple moments that stood out to me. Number one, when he said uh, his confession, he was like, normally I would delete stuff like that. (laughs) He was just a terrible person, man. Terrible. For, especially for people who've never seen an episode. It's the like, worst introduction for him. I was like, he is Now, the FaceTimes where I cheat on my, my girlfriend of I, nine normally, years. I do this all the time, but typically, I, she doesn't find out. Normally, I would. He said. Uh, that was his excuse. Normally, I would have deleted something <laughs> like that. <laughs> He's like, well, it fell out of my phone. I'm sorry. My phone fell out of my pocket. And somebody gave it to Ariana uh, for safekeeping. And here's how. Here's how I knew he was tra- uh, it was terrible after I realized who, who was talking. Ariana was like, something said, just go through my phone. If I'm performing on stage and my phone fell out and somebody handed it to Melissa, she would have put it in her purse. Right. And she would have thought, now I got a chance. Now's the opportunity. At a Double concert check. of all places. Right. Yes. And if she found, if she went in there, she would see TikToks of dogs <laughs> doing funny stuff. <laughs> Yours too? Boy, TikTok <laughs> knows me well. Oh, them dogs. There was a TikTok of a dog. It was like all smiley faces and then a dance and then all smiley faces. The dog was like, and then he was like, and then he went back to smile. I was like, you served me right, TikTok. You served you me right. You knew me well. Oh I got God. something I'm going to send you. Either that or memes. <laughs> the, I, okay, I actually have a funny um, cheater story with one of my friends, and I'm sure you guys have one, but I'll share this. Oh, one. cheater! I'm like cheetah. Oh. <laughs> Why my baby? In the I'm zoo? Animals. I'm animals. <laughs> um, unless I'm wearing it, cheetah prints. Come Hilarious. on, I'm out. You're love funny. I love prints. you so much. Um, I love you. I want to marry you. Yeah. Okay, very good. So <laughs> we, I actually told this story um, at the book club. So if you're a boo, sorry, y'all, I just ruined your cover. Yeah, they don't exist. So I apologize. What yeah, what book club? Sorry. Um, on Friday. So anyway, we have a friend. Uh, her husband left his email open, went to work, left her, his email open. Oh, this is a good one. Oh, yes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Saying. So she goes through, like, hides his little laptop, makes sure he doesn't realize he left his email log- logged in, uh-huh. goes through, finds the email exchange between him and the mistress. Ooh. She then goes to Kinko's, because this is many years ago. Or it could be last year, because it's still Kinko's to this day. It's, I actually agree with that. <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't Kinko's, care what FedEx says. Yeah, yeah. No, oh, yeah, Kinko's. no. Mama name me Kinko's? I'm going to call you Kinko's. Absolutely. Kinko's. I'm going to call you Kinko's. <laughs> she goes to Kinko's, prints off all of the emails, and makes copies, like packets for several different people. <laughs> because at this time, him, the husband, and the mistress are at choir rehearsal. Mm. She goes to the church and hands out copies of this packet <laughs> with their emails to everybody. <laughs> Even the people who oh, just came for choir rehearsal. Yes. Impeccable level of petty. Yeah, I'm trying to tell you. song, everybody. Hold on. <laughs> I want to so lick you. As they are going through <laughs> the, the packet and they start realizing what's happening, she's already turned around. Girlfriend, 
husband and her friend are now chasing after her. They leave. She leaves with our friend. Well, both of them are friends, but she leaves with her friend. They go to the house, tr- completely trash the house, and the house do you How long ago was this? This was probably. At least 10, 15 years ago. It's got to be okay. more than that because we've been here for 10 years. All right, all right. Because I'm thinking for... also. Who does dirt, dirt in the work email? Yeah. This is a while, <laughs> this is a while ago. It is at least 15 years ago. Okay. Because this happened before we plus even met years. them. Yeah, this happened before we met them. Yeah. It's one of my all-time favorite Taking the printed emails to, to a choir rehearsal and giving them to people <laughs> in the choir who are not here, here, even aware. Here, here. Y'all take it past it down. You doing the thumb later? Here. Here, pass it on and there. Ta- also hear that roll? So, uh Tenors, come here. Take a pack, <laughs> take one, move it down. <laughs> yeah. Because that, at that time, that's how they got the new song. Yeah. So they're just like, what is, oh, oh, we got some oh, new music. You what put your this? fingers <laughs> down there. I, I, I could mean, we not have Jesus. been. Like, I couldn't have been in the choir. Yeah, Jesus oh. is a freak this Sunday. All right, we go. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, I couldn't have been. Then I have one more story. One more uh, 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 cheater story. So when I was at work at the, my last company, my coworker was cheating with one of our. Chad, I got two stories, but I'm gonna tell this one. I forgot both of them pe- folks cheated. But anyways, she was cheating with this guy upstairs, and uh, he was married, obviously, and had a baby. They, I told that girl, leave that man alone. He is married. He lying to you because he was like, I'm not married. It's like promise ring. You know, we're not really together. That's just the baby. I wear it because we have a baby together, and we're co-parenting, but we're not together. Girl, uh, he's married. The promise ring with a baby is wild. Yeah, and they live together. It that was is like the all whole this kind of thing. stuff. They only could hang out at work. Like, it was a bunch of stupid stuff. I was like, girl, like. That just yeah. means y'all ain't have money for a wedding. Yes. <laughs> if you got a promise ring and a baby, <laughs> no, y'all, together, y'all together. All the way. So anyway, she uh, kept messing with him, kept messing with him, kept messing with him. Eventually, his wife found out. Mm-hmm. Wife comes up to the job and puts on everybody's car a picture of the girl and puts home record. Oh! And <laughs> puts it on everybody's windshield. Like a club flyer. Like a club flyer. <laughs> 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 Kiko uh-huh. always gets. He's like, hey, come here. But no matter Keisha, what you doing, Keisha, you get them two back rows. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna go over here and work reserved. Stop it by Kiko's first. Yes. <laughs> to yes. All your print needs. You just said mail. <laughs> Work or your yeah. husband cheats. You right. just, you print out you just sat out in front of Kinko's and just <laughs> picked like, now nah, she's here to expose the people somebody. Who work at Kinko's, they kept Marissa was like, ooh. Yeah. 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 That's, that's TMZ right there. Yes. If I saw somebody come in there angry, I'd be like, no, no, let me make your copies for you. Come yeah. on over here. Let me make your copies. You want gloss? I'm the stuff. Give you the good stuff. Give for you. free. I want I'm going to laminate this one. So, Tell you know, me what happened. All weathers. I want to make sure that if you're sitting there for four hours, they, they still know she's a home record. And just in case it rained tonight, we want to steal this. <laughs> yes. You can't okay. have that on regular yeah. eight by half by eleven. She sure did. She did it after lunch. So after, as everybody was getting off work, we all would come. Like me, I went out to my car. What and you had one. Me and um, my coworker that you met at the gym. Yes. Okay. We went out. So, his I'm name was Wesley. But we I'm went out, saw it, more. and was like, "Oh my god!" And so we went back in to be like, "Girl." That's hilarious. Go outside and see what he what she did. And when the so tea is so juicy, off. you don't even leave. Yeah, come, come back in. Like, <laughs> Girl, you got to come out here and see what. Look, look, look. How does she come to work the next day? Because everybody didn't see it. We pulled the ones of the people that didn't leave. Why did y'all rob them of the same? Because we were friends. Got? We were friends with the That's girl. That's not yeah, right. You should have no, sat friends back friends and watched Life Fourth of July. With the home record. Let the machine people who don't know, even know those people be like, well, who's the ho- Look, it would have been a fireworks show so for me. It's like, somebody get, the, y'all pull the, the chairs out. <laughs> That's wrong of y'all. She did, she, because she was young, she was dumb. Yeah. You robbed them people of the no, same thing. No, Let her get no. her grade. So Let her learn the lesson. Yeah. She was so embarrassed. The I did have one is, more story of a cheating story at my job, too. But on Your this job story, was toxic. Child, <laughs> this listen, is Grey's Anatomy. This, it was. This story, another co-worker, actually two co-workers. That's why, that's why, that's why Melissa like this stuff. She that's li- why y'all coming to close She down. lived this stuff. That's she why she like, like it. She it back in my life. <laughs> y'all not turning in them airplane parks when they down there having sex in the yeah. room. <laughs> that's what's wrong with Boeing now. Southwest grounded flights. That's exactly what. They were too busy having sex. <laughs> <laughs> they was out here having sex. So Where are my parts? Me, I, I got my partner. My co-worker, <laughs> my, my favorite co-worker actually, she was like my favorite person that I work with, was in a relationship with another guy that was upstairs. 
And they were together for accounts a long receivable. Time. Or? Huh? <laughs> hey, <Hey-o! laughs> accounts receivable. No, but the accounts receivable girl. Then, but I understand the joke. But she also was in it too. Because we was the one we would tell. Why are you being funny? Yeah, accounts receivable dang. girl was the other person in there. <laughs> Yeah, she sat on the other side. Y'all got a strong be, relationship, Kim, because y'all upheld through all of this. <laughs> Are we what? Y'all. But you know, my coworkers are my coworker, huh? my coworker don't friends. I don't it. hang out with them outside of work. It was so a compliment. I got what you were saying. I but you, I, they only know me from 9 to 5. At 859, don't speak my name. And 512. And at 501, good. don't worry about who I am either. I only know you from these times. So anyway, she, okay, my favorite coworker had um, a relationship. They were in a relationship for a long time. Like before I even started, they, they was in a relationship. Everybody they was in a relationship, they were in a relationship, they were in a relationship. Then she got pregnant, had a baby. Yay, everything's great. Then his daddy died. Okay. When his daddy died, he said that my favorite co worker wasn't there for him emotionally the way that he would have liked it. So then he turned to white girl co worker. Then his penis slipped inside of her. Oh, no. Have you ever slipped inside some coochie? Oh, it's warm. Then she got pregnant. Oh! And was pregnant at the same time as the second baby that my favorite co-worker. So they was having the kids. They was having twins. Wait, something slipped in and something slipped out. But this what happened. What happened? So then (laughs) the white girl went into labor. The man texts his manager, she's in labor, I'm not going to be on, in. The oh, manager man. texted my favorite co-worker, congratulations. <laughs> oh, so wait, this whole time they're pregnant, they don't know they're pregnant by the same Nobody man? Nobody knows. <laughs> congratulations on going into labor. How does that, she looked down at her stomach the and was white like, girl was, going into labor. Was, nobody liked her, but she kept that so tight-lipped until that baby came out. And Look at his nose, yeah. Jay. So then she, he he texts the wrong girl. I'm trying not to say these folks' names. So he texts the wrong girl and was live trying so hard. Text the wrong girl. Congratulations. Even though y'all know who she is. But anyway, congratulations. So she called. Would you congratulate me? I'm at the house. I didn't. The baby is, I, like, ain't nothing happening. It was it prophetic. I so he was too. like, what you mean? Because he knew, though. Yeah, the I manager know. knew oh, what was going on. Yeah. He got to know. You got to let your manager know. Hey, look, Jeff. Yes. This is what's happening. Yes. And I think he actually looked. I How many think paternal time off twice. Twice. <laughs> Two times. And I please. think he, I low key think because we our loyalties lied with the favorite coworker, not the white girl. And I low key think he did it on purpose. I'm not even going to front to you. Now I'm looking at terms. Purpose. I'm like that. So the the yeah, the, black, the, the original chick, she must have went full turn. What was a white girl early? Because she had I her baby she first. Had, yeah, I think she had the baby first. She got pregnant first. Yeah, she got pregnant. She already had a baby. Then the t- kids that were had born together. And he bust them up. Yeah, and both of them. Both but of but the white girl's baby was born first. So she calls. She's These like, what's people. going on? And he was like, uh, 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 tells her. And then. Boss, I'm going to need a raise. <laughs> yeah, we, this is at the end of my last job, mind you. Okay, so this is when. Now, why do you want to go back? Yes. <laughs> but what happened was he quit. And never came That's back. the worst thing he could do. He need that check. Yeah, no, not only that. Listen, you got quit, double and he was the only him. person who knew how to do the parts that were my parts. Oh. It was terrible. But anyways, yeah, he quit. He was doing a lot of parts. And yeah, this was. episode is sponsored by Better Help. <laughs> <laughs> they all need it. <laughs> okay, so, you know, I try to spend time on myself during the week. I try to purposefully make time for myself. That was not something that I was focused on when I was younger. But then I realized, girl, you about to run on an empty tank and you can't do nothing for nobody if you don't fill yourself up. It's so easy to get caught up in what everybody needs from you and really not think about yourself and what you need. But uh, when we, get, especially if you're a giver, when you spend all of your day giving to people, serving people, what do you have left for yourself, right? Well, therapy can give you the tools to find more balance in your life so you can keep supporting others without leaving yourself feeling dry, burnt out, and just not having the energy to just deal with you. Um, I am in therapy right now. I love my therapist. She has been an advocate for me to really do the things that are best for me, 
before thinking about all the other things for other people. And it has made me a better person, a better wife, a better mom. Um, so I highly recommend therapy because it's just super helpful to one to set learning how to set boundaries and also learning how to actually uh, articulate your needs. If you're thinking about starting therapy, give BetterHelp a try. It's entirely online, designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited to your schedule. Just fill out a brief questionnaire to get matched with a licensed therapist and switch up therapists anytime for no additional charge. Find more balance with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash TBTV today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash TBTV. So I have, so I'm not going to say this person's name. But I only know, I'm trying to figure out how much of this person that I should let y'all know that I know about him. Anyways, he was dating this one chick. And she felt like something was up. The one chick was a friend of mine, right? And um, she felt like something was up. And she was really like to the point of like, we either need to piss or get off the pot, right? He was like dragging his feet. He left to go out of town. Same thing. He left his email open. Mm. And she sees correspondence. Uh, he says he's going. He doesn't say he's going out of town. I forget where he says he's going, but not out of town. And um, what he accidentally didn't do or he should have done, I think he picked up his phone and she could hear the airport in the background. And she sees where he's going, right? And uh, he apparently met this chick at some conference. And so he was going out to fly mm. to be with her. So she finds out that he's cheating. And I do believe she uh, physically assaulted him when he got back, right? <laughs> so then they break up. He goes to be with this one chick. They together. They're engaged. Somebody sends him a video of his girlfriend having a threesome with two dudes. Oh, That's karma. Well, fiance. Yeah, his, yeah, fiance. While she's a fiance. Ring on the finger. Get smashed by two dudes. That's karma. I, hot, when this girl that's told delicious. me the story. That's poetic justice. <laughs> I. That's poetic. Hollered. I was just like, oh. this was. That's this perfection. Was, this was everything I needed to yeah, be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything. And more. And actually, no, that girl didn't tell me the story. One girl told me, the, the ex-girlfriend told me the he cheated, they broke up. Because I was like, what happened with y'all? Then a mutual friend of mine and his told me about the the video being sent. I said, <laughs> "What? Oh. oh, it felt so good to hear. That's fantastic. I ain't saying no names is my favorite segment on R and B money, and that's essentially what we just yeah, did. Yeah, I ain't saying no names because I could have gave more details that would have made the story even juicier. But then it was going to tell who the person was, and I ain't mm. trying to be that messy. I got I got one. You do? <clears throat> yeah, I, I I hadn't told you this one. No names. No names. Oh. No, names. no names. So actually, the, I can share these names. Oh, I uh, think I know what you're going to say. Yeah. So I almost thought about sharing this story. <laughs> I was feeling left out. <laughs> sharing this story. So our home. Listen, girl, you you on home run level right yeah. now. You got eight stories. Make sure he tells it right. Oh, your hands are cold. Feels good. <laughs> she was uh, our home girl's like the oldest, right? Of her siblings, her mom was sick and stuff. So all the family's trying to figure out what to do with the house and stuff like that. And her and her husband had like a lot of trouble. Her cousin moves in with them. She had been with them for a long time. She's out of oh, town. You, you're not telling the story. I thought you. Okay. Were Cousin, I think her name was like Faith or something like that. He talking about soul food. I know. I knew. No, Faith. I knew as soon as he said, before yeah. he started, I was like, he's not telling a real yeah, story. Yeah. I couldn't figure out where it was going either. Faith, she ha was a dancer. The only reason why I and walk in is because you Terry got pulled the knife out. Because <laughs> Terry said, as soon as the family after my husband, I was like, you black bastard. Oh, this is soul food. Because the other story I was going to say, I'm not going to go into detail. I'm going to give it real high level. <laughs> give me so high that level. I don't give no no nobody's a waste. How'd you know I was lying? Because as you soon, I was like, why would I know the oh, soul food? Yeah. Um, Her name is Faith. Yes. Yeah. So we know someone <laughs> that was married. And then he did. She, The wife cheated with somebody we know. And they said it was a quick yes, no. That phrasing I knew would get you to know who I'm talking about. <laughs> but why has I shoot that? 
We got to tell y'all that story in full oh, with we, the cameras off. We hit him. Look, look. We only got one more. I'm going to switch it up a little bit. I got to leave at 1215. I got I got Okay, we got to get up out of here. Me, without you. No, no, don't tell them until I can be there. No, man, did nobody tell you have stuff to do? Yes, I can. As much tea as I done gave you today, me and Josh support you up. Go ahead. So, ain't oh, it was something, some dude's going viral right now about his homeboy trying to cheat. And he was like, no. I didn't put, I didn't put all this money into this tux and going to your wedding and stuff. This ain't happening. That's my thing. Don't involve me. Don't pull, bring my name up <laughs> if you're doing you. dirt. That's what happened I've with been, shorts. I've That's been what put, happened with shorts. I've been put in those situations. Oh, have you? Bring. What's up? So do you tell? Hey, because if you're shorts, what do you do? This is exactly what happened. Uh, where did you and my husband go last night? I was at home. I haven't talked to your husband in two weeks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Listen. I was right. Because here's the thing. You can't. We can't be a close friend group. Melissa called me talking about take where you and Kev go, and then I'm sitting here lying to my friend's face. No. Listen. To you. Get your shit together. Don't pull me in on this. I found out this. Uh, I was in the green room one time, and this, these two comics was like, one was like, yo, if my girl calls, tell them I was with you. And I was like, were y'all not together? And they were like, Kev, we don't involve you in this. Don't involve me, because I'm you, going to dry And I'd be you. like. I first of all, dry or wet, I'm telling the truth. Like Will Smith said, tell the truth. Shut up. I don't have to lie. When you don't lie, you don't have. The, I don't have to think. If you ask me where I was, do you talk to Tank? Yeah, I talked to Tank on Tuesday. Mm, that ain't what he told me. Well, it's what I know. To be <laughs> <true>. <laughs> I, don't, I don't. I don't. I'm going to think about it. I'm not assuming he ain't going to tell you something, and that ain't my issue. Inevitably, it's, it's going to come out. It's going to come out. No. So you've been lying. So so you've been lying. But Kev, so what, what ain't you told me? Now it's here. Now you in trouble. Right. That's what, that's what happened to Schwartz. That's what happened with Schwartz. That's what happened at church. Somebody was cheating. Child, I know entirely too many cheating uh, You, there's a bunch that I just know I can't say nothing. <laughs> you know you can't say nothing? I just know I can't say nothing. <laughs> I just, man, I, I don't even cheat on tests. Listen, I have been places where the person has walked in with the person they should not be with. And oh. she called me. I said, I said Angel be an angel. It. I said, shut up and just watch what happens. <laughs> no, <laughs> Angel got to go over and hold a conversation. No, no. no. This was already after I had already did that. <laughs> so you caught them twice? No, 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 no. I called him after the fact. Oh, he oh, thinking called I called him. him during the fact. Oh, no, I was mad. I was like, why didn't you just? Because right now you have no proof. It was just like, oh, it was so just wait, two what friends. Did you do? do you confront them? It was a thing because I was just like, this don't make no sense. What I'm seeing, I see the person I know first, so I'm excited to see that. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. And then I see someone that does not make sense in the equation in there. The physical energy also doesn't, doesn't match. Make sense. What is hey. it? This should be copacetic. It yeah. ain't. Right. <laughs> so the hello, the, the name of the person was flying out of my mouth before... But you could tell by that per how the person approached me and how they were trying to explain the situation. I was like, you got to be effing kidding. <laughs> so do you tell your friend, they husband, wife, whatever, is... is I tried. Oh, and then what happened? She was being dumb, dumb, like Same old girl like, uh, Ariana. Ariana, I wanted to tell you I've been cheating on you, but yeah. your energy said was, I cannot tell it you. It was one of those things of like, I'm trying to, I'm trying to fit, because like he said, I didn't have enough proof to be like, this is oh, what sure. I know, but I'm like. Now, if you sit back and watch the peck on the, ch oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, you know, sure. yeah, but because I didn't see it, but I, but I know what I, you know, I. Have, yeah, it was obvious. God though. has showed me enough intuition that I know what I see and I know what I see, and I was like, so I saw, and I was like, they were there with, and uh, the person was like, oh, they were there with probably such and such, and I was like, who's such and such, such and such, and I said that. <laughs> That don't, Hold up. That, that's this, not the name. That's literally. Not the name. That's, no, that's not the name. Hold that up. Go with that person. Then literally the person that Angel saw with somebody calls me literally within minutes. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> what's going on? I was like, so I know I saw Yeah, what's up? up? Oh, yeah, you know. Hey, I'm at work, man. I'll holler at you later <laughs> on. <laughs> Remember we was at work together when yeah. I got a job at your job yeah. today? Please, please tell them how you hired me for just this one day. Eventually, the person saw everything, and we talked about it. And I was like, you 
swatted down every attempt that I yeah. tried. And, and that she, person was like, I know. They were like, I I, I figure. I, she was like, I really knew what, what you were trying to tell me. She was like, I just wasn't ready. In a to. place of perceiving. And I was like, I, I wanted to be like, listen to me. But I was like, I <laughs> Yeah, because sometimes you do. speak up when you tell somebody you see something, they'll get mad at the person that tells them. Absolutely. That's true. 1,000%. That's why I was wondering if what do you... How what do you do you I usually keep it to my. I, I'm like, you know what? I see this. Let y'all do y'all, but don't pull me in it. So would you? You. So have you, you ever been this restaurant yet? Yeah, who'd you see there? So and so and so and so. But I ain't just gonna openly because I don't know. I don't be knowing what's going on. It depending on the friend. <laughs> I don't be knowing. Uh, it, yeah. But if I consider you a friend, friend, I'm gonna say. Even if you end up mad at me, I'm gonna say something. Yeah. I am the what I would I don't prefer. Have my preference is if I. Am aware of so the person that is doing the offense is aware of me and aware that I see it. Well, because usually I'm going to make you aware that I see it. I'm not going to leave as if <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm going to give them the first option. Oh, I would prefer you. I'm going to tell her next Wednesday. You got that much time. You got from now until next Wednesday. Pretty much. It's either coming from you or me. Yeah, that's that's usually my my mo because you you're not going to have that on my conscience and also. It should be you saying it. It should not have to be me. That should be you. But yeah, I, listen. I've known. I've known the offender and the offended. Mm. Mm. So mm. I'd be like, "Ooh, everybody's out That's here cool. being yeah. crazy." Uh, so what do you all plan on doing this summer? Do y'all got any big plans? We're going on vacation. We're going uh, taking our sons on an HBCU tour. I'm really excited about that. And whatever else you need for us to set up this ad. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> don't you hate though when you go out of town and you can't like when you're trying to have all of the trash up out of your house but there's always still some trash that's left in the the herby kirby mm-hmm. outside and you can't get it to the front of the house because you ain't there right i have this problem often well listen listen not anymore i had it the the they they don't have this problem anymore because you all have lonely yep Yes, y'all do have Lomi, and it's changed y'all's life. Uh, I can't wait to get the Lomi. They took the one that they gave us uh, for this ad. It's a, it's a uh, what do you call it? It is a garbage, uh, not compactor. Composter. Composter. Com- I'm sorry. I was like, what is the word that I'm trying to use? Mm-hmm. It is uh, sits on your countertop, and it, it's a, a countertop electric composter that turns food scraps to dirt in under four hours. Now, what's great about it is that when you're thinking about food waste, especially with a family of six, there's a lot of food waste in that a lot of that is going into the garbage. A lot of that is smelling up your house. But with Lomi, you do not have that problem. And it's fun. There's no more food rotting in the garbage, smell it at the kitchen. Thanks to Lomi, you only have to take the trash out once a week, and it's hassle-free, mess-free, and no more leaky bags. Ugh. Ugh. So the Fredericks are now able to turn their waste into nutrient-rich dirt. That can help feed their plants, lawn, or garden, which means it's not going into the landfills. It's produ- is in producing methane gas, uh, and Cow you farts. get to help, and you get to help the environment and make life easier. Um, so, uh, Melissa, I know you all have the Lomi. Yes, tell me about you all's experience with it. it. It's it's uh, um, it's a lot of fun. First of all, it, mm-hmm. yes, it is great for the environment. But as adults, we don't do things that are fun. And <laughs> science experiments low key be fun. So yes. you put food in, and then like within a few hours, it's dirt. And as a not forty year old. It's mesmerizing. Right. <laughs> well, as a 40-year-old, I am jealous. <laughs> it does bring out the inner child in you, and I do. Like, oh, cool, this is helping the earth. But also, it's just really convenient for our life. Yeah. Because you don't, you feel bad for wasting And your stuff. trash gets full. Trash gets full. It stinks. We also have a dog. Mm-hmm. And if you don't, you leave food out, he'll eat it. His stomach hurts. It, it's helpful in every way. So whether you want to start making a positive environment, environmental impact or just grow a beautiful garden, Lomi is perfect for you. Head to Lomi.com slash TBTB. TBTB. Use the promo code TBTB. TBTB. To get $50 off your Lomi. That's $50 off when you head to L-O-M-I dot com slash TBTB. TBTB. And use code promo code TBTB. TBTB. At checkout. Thank you, Lomi, for sponsoring this episode. I want to say something before we run out of time, and I want to say this about okay. Tom Sandoval. He is the worst 
fake crier. Oh my God, wasn't it terrible? In the history I've ever seen in reality. so much. He is so To everyone uh, but Ariana. Everybody up, mm-hmm. Ariana, exactly. He did not care about cheating on this girl at all. None. He did not feel bad. No. In their first uh, conversation, he yelled at her because he was talking about how much of the... Uh, a friend, Ra- Ra- Rachel. Raquel. We have Raquel. such a deep connection. Yes. Apparently, yeah. her real name is Rachel. She just goes by Raquel. Yeah, it sounds okay, funner. That, that's why she cheats. Um, <laughs> and he well, like Rachel you don't Raquel. you don't know everything. I'm leaving. <laughs> and goes to Schwartz. I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> <laughs> they were they were only the sad bar. because it impacted their bottom His line. His boy was like, "Listen, and man, I'm so sorry, man. I feel Schwartz, bad for you. Uh, you Schwartz messed up. Are we up? Uh, the only person that was <laughs> yep, like." Was, his Half intentions a star. were very obvious mm-hmm. yes. when he was confronted. Can you just let people know I'm not a bad guy? Yeah, Our Yelp a reviews. Could you do a pose? He poured a beer into a glass, <laughs> dude. I was like, "What? Why? What are you doing? Anybody do that? Not I mean, at the house. That, that, that do you beer. have a soda? <laughs> Coors Light." He was like, "Dude, this is terrible." We the Coors so is that ones. a sponsorship? The Coors was pouring hard in that whole episode. Sure. I think it is. Don't nobody like Coors. Like, like, we have one star. <laughs> this this place was decorated by Lego builders. So I was like, you know, you mad when you make it up. I put stuff. everything into this. I, Shorts, you need a new friend. Yes, you are. It seems that he is constantly giving you the short end of the stick because you constantly have to cover for him. He's giving the long end of the stick to Raquel. Correct. Mm -hmm. Listen, this is what I thought was funny that everybody kept saying. And I was like, oh, this is great. So, you know, I'm not your friend anymore. Oh, oh they made Dude, that this is clear. Big time middle school. Immediately. We're not friends anymore. Y'all all on the same show. Y'all going to be friends. (laughs) Girl in white. Shanisha. Sheena. The other white girl. Sheena. She was hurt. Yeah. She was like, I'm not your friend anymore. But I'm going to miss you. Yeah, I'm going to miss you. Listen, if I'm not your friend no more, I ain't going to say it. You're going to feel it. She, Period. That's, that's all. <laughs> the girl, when she said, I regret ever loving you. That hurt me to uh, my I core. She said, I, re- I, I, I was, uh, she said, well, I, I was right or die for mm-hmm. you. I regret ever loving you. I regret the time spent on you. I was like, Shit. I will regret it too. Ten years? That's a long but after I mean, the he first cheat, girl, cheated every three years. So he cheated <laughs> to get with you. He and cheated that's my on Kristen. Yeah, that's her karma. When Kristen showed up, the ex girlfriend to burn stuff and and to click uh, tuning forks by her head, I said, "Oh, bitch, you just don't make good choices." Hold up, but didn't she get with him by him cheating on that's somebody? What I yes, said, so yeah, that, that, that's the girl. Okay, though. this is her karma. Then that's what she get. She was like, "I didn't know that you guys were together." And you know, we kissed, but I didn't know. And they show the scene because this is all happened on the show. <laughs> all that happened all on the within the last God, ten day. seasons of this show. Fifteen seasons of they, they haven't cooked a burger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, people are still waiting on their water at the table. Is someone going to bring me water? Hold on. I'm still having Too sex with Raquel. Sex. <laughs> That's all they're doing. They don't even work at the restaurants no more. They got their own restaurant. Yeah. Well, uh, Schwartz works at the restaurant. Tom Tom? Tom Tom. That's yes. their restaurant. That's why it's called Tom Tom. Yeah, Lisa yeah. Vanderpump owns that? Yeah, of yes. course. Lisa Vanderpump owns anything. Their children, if they pop out there. Yes. She owns everything. Her and Andy together. Yes. And Lisa just shows up with her her uh, false lashes and Botox. She's like, oh, darling. Oh, darling. This is so terrible. You is that that away. older lady that was yes. on there? Yeah, she's a real I hot thought that was that else. girl's mama. <laughs> I was so confused. Yo, she is. She's, she's old enough to be a mama, mama ain't she? Oh, I yeah, she's got a daughter her age. Yeah, okay. she has a daughter and an adopted son, Yeah, from what I know. But I literally, I, when I tell you I had no idea who these white people were. Oh, no, Lisa. Not were. a clue. I don't know who they are. Lisa and her husband... Uh, what was her husband's name? Was his James? Um, and Reggie they have Jones. A, <laughs> it's Reggie. And they have a dog mm-hmm. named Izzy. Uh, that don't have no hair on its body. Get no, not Izzy. Uh, Iggy. They ain't got no hair on their body. Oh my god. She is a hoot and a holler. She know how to stay up in the mess and just be like. She said, um, I don't think a hug would be appropriate, and I feel like the weather. Ken. It's her a hug. Ken, Ken, Ken. 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 <laughs> oh, a hug. Yeah, when she was, and I don't think a hug would really be uh, appropriate. Right now, oh, and the then she said, and the weather is foreboding what the conversation will be. <laughs> and then he goes off. Yeah, I just can't. Oh, I hated it. Yeah, and she never like, t- dropped a tear. 
in that he episode, a tear never came out. And apparently out. made a post on social media apologizing to the restaurant sure before he That's the thing. apologized to the girlfriend. He don't that, And she made a good point in their breakup. And you know they ain't still together today? I they seen still it on are? the news. No. No, they, oh, him and the white girl? Of course they're not. They're, he's not with Ariana. Raquel he ain't with Raquel. He got oh, a, no, Raquel, yeah. no he's cheating he's on the, some younger, yeah, newer say, TikTok girl. He's cheating on somebody else now. What are y'all talking right, about? He's with the Raquel girl? They almost kissed in front. He was like, it feels odd to kiss in front oh, of Oh, my now. God. She was like, yeah, and then the little cut. He was like, oh, my God. The yeah, fuck? she they said, were sitting so I punched awkward. that B. No one said that. Yeah. yeah. No one said that. Yes, his legs was like all tucked up in his body. Oh, so up. weird. It was all, and then what else? He's like he a did? pirate too. He, he looked a mess. There was something else he said that made me That's want what, to vomit. Let's end though, because I want we want to tell you the story before we gotta go. All right, and put the beginning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, and yeah, put, the we can put the beginning. It's okay. Dear, dear Aubrey, put a little bit of that beginning chatter. Leave it. Leave it here. Leave it. We need oh. to do it the way uh, the people do on um. Forget it. Thanks, y'all. Child, you know I binged it. it. Uh, the thing about it is, the next this season should have been twelve episodes or fifty, whatever it is. Yes, and it was very abrupt. I, 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 I want, I want them more. Yeah, they did the same thing. The couples room. Yes. No, complete. Absolutely. Yes. She said. Oh, did she? Amanda? Amanda? Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's good to know. Oh, I was. Oh, that's why we couldn't do Tuesday. I won't be here, Kevin. <laughs> Is that it? I was like, no, somebody has something to do. And forgot it was me. It, I literally said, this is entertainment, and I'm here for it. I told Tony Baker that Fast and Furious is wrestling a movie. If you can just accept those movies for what they are, and you will have the funnest two hours. A little bit long. It was a little long. But I... Yeah. Jason Momoa. Oh, my God. Freaking fantastic. It took me 30 minutes. Understand his character though because how he introduced. Yes. Yes. Oh my God. Yes. The Joker. Yes. He said the same thing. The same thing. He would be good in Pirates of the Caribbean. I want to see him do more chaotic, yes. crazy but roles. Oh, I, his fingernail polish uh -huh. when he had his hair in the Liz, pigtails. You're, you haven't seen it. I didn't say no words. I knew I let, I've seen that film pretty. Yeah, I didn't oh. even. There's no, there's no plot line. I didn't say no words. Yeah. I mean, that was hilarious it's to us. It's I mean, you can't spoil yeah, it. It's not Mr. Glass or something. That's true. <laughs> um, I, I like. I got to start talking first, but I want this to say. I literally throughout the movie, I was like, "Oh no, I am totally in." I and it's a three-part series too. Josh showed me this 4DX thing where you, be, <laughs> when the car shake, your seat shakes. When it snows, mm. it snows in the movie theater. Me and and I was like, how we gonna see it. if we, if That's I had fun. known that, I would have 1,000% paid to go wherever that is. Where Do did we have you take Zay? Where was that at? I was in, that was in Oxnard. Oxnard. Oh, really? I didn't realize. It's too, it's too late. I don't know. I don't know that much about Oxnard. But it was some abandoned factory. I, I, mean, not, I mean, it was abandoned. I mean, not abandoned, uh, defunct. And the guy, some guy just bought it and then was like, I could use it for production as a location. So they apparently. Did, they did shoot it in Oxnard. Yeah. And we, we were close to meeting Nas, but boy, music video. This is when it was actually being shot. That's when those pictures were actually taken. Yeah. You're oh, just now posting them. It was, it was, that was yesterday. No, that was yesterday. Was they in the oh. video? No, no, no. It was just really cold out there. So he, I was like, can he put on one of these jackets? Because apparently they had told the production, like, on the call sheet, they were like, it is freezing out here. Bring a hoodie. Bring a jacket. It's really cold. Yes. So we get out of the car. I'm like, oh, my God. And Isaiah was like, dang, I didn't bring a jacket. That's because I So he wasn't going. He wasn't finna be outside. If it wasn't for it. Was, yeah. if, it wasn't, if, if they didn't have that jacket for him to wear, he would have been outside. It was oh, so, so funny because he, he was. up to the shoot. Yeah. Oh, he was a little kid. Like a, I thought it was like some kind of. Activation? Mm -mm. No, no. They were shooting a music video. Oh, when fine. we saw that Optimus Prime, 
both of us was like, oh, it's Optimus. <laughs> <laughs> that was so good. And that Porsche had the Transformers logo on the oh, where cool. the car logo yeah, goes. That's cool. And the crazy thing about and I was like, this is how these budget gets good too. Not only do they have the you know they have like the uh, drivers uh-huh. who drive. Porsche has a Porsche representative. Only the Porsche representative can drive the Porsche. Yeah, they don't be playing. And the games. Bumblebee, the Camaro representative, or uh, mm-hmm, who's that? Mm-hmm. GMC. Mm-hmm. They yeah. can only. You can't even. And the semi dr- hey, guy can only drive the semi guy. Hey, and he, the COI probably for each of those companies that they have. Absolutely. What's COI? So uh, insurance. insurance? Absolutely. Yeah, they were like, can you scoot the car up again? And can you guys get the par- can you guys get the um Porsche yeah, driver? Gonna, uh, and there's another driver who actually transports those, but he does not drive them. Right. Yeah, he he, tr- he moves them, but then he can't drive them. I could imagine. Ain't the that ridiculous? Of, I, I could imagine the type of stuff they go through, especially if they featuring a car in a movie because they have to make the mo- the car look good. One thousand percent. And like you know that uh, the first one, GM sued Transformers because really? no no or Transformers may have sued GM because they used the design of their Camaro to make the new co- model of the Camaro. Uh, that really? Was a- that was actually Transformers design, and GM took it. And made it? Yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> hey, man, y'all did a good job. Yeah. Arthur, fact, yeah. put, that in, put that in for the new Camaro. That's why the uh, fat, um, Gone in 60 Seconds, that mm-hmm. Eleanor car, yeah. it's illegal to re- replicate that car. Oh, that's why I have those ones. You that's can crazy. literally, people, like, they think we they said, like, 11 people got sued. Or for making gray, it in their, themselves like in their body shop. I like either, actually. And what? driving it around, they can, you can get sued that's for that. I don't know why we have oh kids, but we do. Oh, we love them. That's so interesting how these doggone things get so expensive. You waited as, you waited as long as you could. I, no, I want her to get restrained. in there. I'm, I can't eat before we I know. start. I'm just saying. Well, can't tells like can't Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> he tried to, his best to restrain. He was like, come on, get get in, jump in. Go in there. Lisa said my stack my uh, day. <laughs> paperwork came in that was like vote for the author. Uh, what was it? Authorization for, for, for strike. strike. For the strike. Mm-hmm. They said, what you think, Kev? I said, I don't get booked no way, so let's strike it up. <laughs> <laughs> At least I can go down there and meet some folks. We got to get this AI under control. Hmm? Somebody get some hokas? Everybody on Twitter been talking about them hokas. Hokas look fire. Hey, we got some hokas. Hokas is some big old. Hokas? Hokas. Yeah. Hokas. I just did a brand big old with bulky them. bottoms. But I'm gonna tell you what, they are it feels like you're the walking most on a cloud. Comfortable mm. shoes I've ever had on. Those ASICs are really comfortable. Are some Nikes that look a, I'm gonna oh, show you these damn ones, things. They the ugliest pair of Nikes Nike? I've ever seen. Yes. Oh, oh but they're comfortable. They are so goddamn comfortable. Man, I had some Air Max on. I was telling Melissa they things were I mean, they had my toes screaming. Man, feet are hot Bruh, ASICs on the first like second you put them on. They feel amazing. Yeah. I ain't never tried the Hoka's on, but all the old oh. that I follow on Twitter that are my age are like, nah, listen, you can laugh at them Hoka, but they feel all right. They do. They feel really good. You know, I got that plantar fasciitis. And Hoka, they got money because sure enough, the, uh, the uh, what's them people's name? Glenn and Yvette mm-hmm. Henry, they drove up for the brand new. Mm. Oh. I said, and they, they always include that, too. They don't play no games out there. The mm-hmm. whole family came up. When mm-hmm. I saw them there, I said, ooh, they, mm-hmm. y'all good. <laughs> good, good, clean. Mm-hmm. Are you going down to Essence? I hope so. I need to make it known that I want a brand to take me, and I'm also going to talk to my person, because I don't. I want to go to make money. Mm-hmm. You don't want to just go. That's what me and Melissa said. I want to. anybody bringing us, we'll see y'all the next time. He said, "Come on, let me." He's like, "Let me." Let Kev me actually tried. I act, I literally asked like him. He actually did. We supposed to set a call. I was like, "What?" Because what y'all asking for? We need to bring our person. So mine is there's an older version of these, and there's like on mine there's no middle part like arch. The arch is empty, and it's just like a heel and the bubble toe. They are hideous, but I tell you, these things are so goddamn comfortable. Well, let me get you some Hoka. <laughs> At our age, Marcus, you are making a choice. I'm gonna get some. Oh, they so comfortable. The, the Hoka. I got Sabra. Oh my God, today. I need they to go down to Dick's. Not Dick's. And they have some pretty colorways, actually. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah. Pretty good, yeah. Dick's got them old running shoes yeah. right all up. That's mostly mm-hmm. old. You can't get them new bronze, but you want them Asics? Oh, nigga. Them walking oh, shoes? I have a bronze in like a 14. <laughs> <laughs> the arch support bronze. They got, uh, though, because those shoes are made for walking. Every other shoes shoe is lifestyle shoes. Yes, absolutely. 